Yeah, hi guys, welcome once again back to Ian's vlog. And where are we now? Well, judging by the songbird we just heard over there, it can only be France. We are in the south of France, we're in Antibes, we're in the market on the French Riviera. Yeah, I just want to kind of basically give you a little bit of an insight, you know, to what you can, well, what we've been doing down here. And the uh, exciting thing that we did yesterday was we went to the islands, uh, the Ile de la Ronde, in search of the man in the iron mask. And um, yeah, watch on, you'll enjoy this. part of the journey is going to take us now uh, on the bus we're going to get the bus from outside the hotel and uh, off, we go, off we go down into Antibes where we're going to connect from the main station uh, we're going to get the train to Cannes but the first part of the journey is the local bus <laughs> Chasing one leaf gave me the fingers up, huh? Good man. Yeah, I don't really have kind of a storyboard. I don't really know what's going on today in regards to uh, a, a, a major kind of theming of this video. It's, it's more of a walkabout, a little walkabout and a talkabout, and. You know we can show you some of the nice things that we can that we're experiencing down here in the south of France on the French Riviera. At the moment we're at the main station in Antibes and we're attempting to get a train. Tickets we've got already, already got tickets. I'm gonna get a train to Cannes. <laughs> so good to be I mean it's so nice to be back in Cannes again it's been quite quite some time now since I personally have been um, been in Cannes and it brings back lots of memories because I have spent quite some time here in my younger days in my youth and yeah and, and the atmosphere in the morning before the sun gets very high before it gets very hot is always it's very special in places like Cannes where Hi! <laughs> yeah, well, you know, people are all enjoying the, the shops and the bakeries and the coffee places. And like everyone's in a good mood, Every, everybody's basically smiling and waving, you know. This, this is Cannes. 
but of course it wouldn't be canned without a little Frenchman taking his doggy for a walk. Looks like we're on the right way. Hop on, hop off. This is the old port. Um, obviously, when, when Cam was a fishing village, you know, this, this was the original port and then later became very, very famous, very big. And they built the, the new port on the other side, on the other side of Cam there. sure where we are at the moment because the last time that I went to the islands uh, the boat and the ticket office uh, were both on the other side by the, uh, the, the festival hall the boats are lovely there's John John down John John I think we found the ticket office and it seems to be about leaving at 10.30. So, bonjour, bonjour madame. St. Marguerite, St. Marguerite, deux hadoles. Silhouette, loop silhouette. Hey, what up? Yeah, see what we see here. Yeah, it looks like we made it. So let's wait for the journey to start at 10.30. The boat heads towards the island of Saint Marguerite on the archipel, small archipelago of Ile de Réron. Roasting away like two little chickens in the oven. So hot. <laughs> I can't go. <laughs> there it is. I really, I really love this kind of barren sort of castle land, you know, the, the, this island, this deserted island kind of um, atmosphere. Yeah, the only thing that, well, not the only thing that's missing because very soon I think we're going to bump into something 
um, in that way, in that sense, is a beach because the first chance I get to jump in the water, in the ocean, I will be taking it. Yeah, I do, I do hope you enjoyed that. Um, yes, and eventually we did find him. We did find the man in the iron mass. Well, at least we found his cell where, where the, the buggers, they locked him away for about 10 years in this stony little cell. And nobody knows his identity. Nobody. Yeah, that was, that was, the, uh, that was the day trip to Cannes yesterday. Let's take a look around. Huh? We're heading towards the, the port, towards the beach. So there's going to be kind of a different atmosphere as we move away from sort of the market space, from, from the quaint little shops and the rest of it. Um, but as I said, let's, let's take a little look around. This side of my shoulder, we've got the boats already in the old port. Smaller boats, probably belonging to the local fishermen, local guys. And on the other side, we've got the run parts with the, the old town of Antibes placed just over the wall there. Um, we're gonna do what I'm gonna do now. I'm gonna spend a couple of hours on the beach because it's an absolutely glorious day, it's fantastic, it's beautiful. So, beach life. Yeah, it's a little bit packed at the moment, but it's, it's, a, it's quite a nice beach. Um, what time is it now? It's just after lunch, and really it's time to get some, some refreshments, so nip off to the little, little kiosk down the road and pop up with some something again you know. Ah, oh, it's ice cold. And then, yeah, for lunch we have something which, um, I think when I first came down here as a young lad, I think I used to live on these things. They call them a pan bagnon. And what they are basically, they are, um, it's basically a whole salad niçoise stuck between uh, two pieces of bread. And if you open up there, you can see all the tuna fish and the anchovies and the olive oil and all the peppers and salad and onions and radishes and everything. And um, we literally, we used to live on these things. And, and I'm so happy, I'm so happy that they still stole them, really because they are delicious, just what you need on the beach for lunch.